and to the rest of Africa, we go to Mali, where its military government has pushed through a political charter to establish an 18-month transitioning government that could lead to the appointment of a soldier as an interim president, despite objections from the coalition that led uh, anti-government protests before last month's coup. Approval for the roadmap meant to chart the country's course after the August 18 coup that toppled and battled President Ibrahim Boubacar Keita came on Saturday after three days of negotiations between the military government, political leaders and civil society groups. Regional and international powers fearful that political instability will undermine a years-long fight against armed groups across West Africa's Sahel region have pushed for a swift transition back to civilian rule. The charter says the interim president can be a civilian or a soldier and will preside over a transitional period of 18 months before elections are held. And that's according to Musa Kamara, the spokesman for the talks. Joining us live now to make sense of all of this is Tidiani Togola, who is the CEO of Tuwindi. Good to have you, Mr. Togola. Good morning. Good morning to you. Now, do you consider this a good compromise, the 18 month uh, transition period? You will recall that the military wanted three years initially and ECOWAS gave them 12 months. So is 18 months okay in your opinion? Um, thank you very much. Um, into my opinion, I think uh, the, the, the duration can be 12 months. Since uh, the, the all beginning, I was saying the same thing. For me, 12 months is a very good period. But uh, if uh, if they decide together during the, you know, the, the national consultation, the, everybody decides to say, okay, 18 months is a good, uh, is a good, good, good duration. Mm -hmm. Then uh, it's possible to go with uh, 18 months. But all this depend on the content of, uh, mm -hmm. you know, on, on of the content of the roadmap. And um, the, for me, the, dura the this, this roadmap is too big. Um, has um, has roadmap, you know, they just need to be more focused on the reform and security issues. These are the most important thing, but I've seen they've taken like, uh, you know, uh, five priorities that is not, uh, according to me, required. Hmm. All right, the charter also specifies either a military or civilian heads, uh, the interim government, to be appointed by the military. Isn't the charter unfair to the civilian population? You know the charter is uh, very protested and contested in 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 Mali because uh, the, the the whole I mean the whole element that people were discussing about, uh, I mean the different agreement wasn't like not taken account in 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 the in the the, the last version of the chapter so that's why uh, of course the the, chap the chapter can can is continue to will probably continue to cause. Um, to cause more problem. In addition to that, we need to 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 be listening to what the ECOWAS, ECOWAS is saying also in terms of uh, the sanction, in terms of uh, in terms of everything. So, in terms of the, the the title of the who will be leading the country, if you go through this chapter, you can see that everybody every single thing is decided by military. So, this is also something that can irritate people. Right, the opposition, which is M5 RFP, which led the protest leading to the ousting of President Keita, is crying foul over the transition plan. Is their reservation legitimate? Yeah, it's very, you know, it legitimate. It's not only um, only M, uh, M, M5 RFP. It uh, the, the many over participants in this, uh, you know, in this uh, consultation said that the the. The, the chapter had been modified is not reflecting what they want so that's why they are refusing mm -hmm. and um, also the military has given the feeling to people that they want to, to to stay here we need also to to remember that mali used to to have a, you know to have different coup d'etat since uh, musa Traoré, and the, the duration they used to say is not the duration they used to respect so mm -hmm. that's why uh, people here don't want to, 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 I mean, are not really ready to, to, to be confident in, in, right. in them. So it, it's very legitimate when they, they review this, uh, this, this document. All right. Uh, Idana, th there is also the fear by the international communities that having the military in power will further escalate, you know, the level of insecurity in some parts of Mali. Do you agree with that position? 
you know, my own opinion is that um, if we don't do anything, this the insecurity will uh, just uh, will just just go go up and go up, and uh, it will be more complicated. For now, this is you know what we call the hivernage, the 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 raining season. So after this raining season, I'm sure that the the insecurity issue will uh, will be more more concerning and will be more complicated to 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 fix. That's why uh, the statue of the person is not the most important thing for now. The, the most important thing for now is the content and the, the, the duration and the content, according to me, is just uh, re, uh, the security and the reform and the, the who and the duration is 12 months is, will be a good thing to, to have international community with us and also to, to bring all, all actors, all stakeholders uh, together. Mm-hmm. All right, before I let you go, I'm just wondering what exactly is the mood, you know, of the people generally outside a partisan interest? What is it like out there today? Sorry, can you repeat, please? Yeah, I said, I'm just wondering, away from, you know, politics, what's the mood generally of people in Mali? You know, the general mood is, you know, we, we here, we are in a kind of, um, a kind of, uh, how, how we say that? Um, I mean, we're not very feeling well with this situation mm. because of, uh, you know, the uncertainty regarding the question of, 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 uh, of sanction. And also uh, people want to move now forward and uh, forward. Um, the general mood is not very good mood and people are just in the, in the uncertainty. And we want this to be, to be, to be changed in mm. something more clear so we can move forward. Yeah, I can hear all the concerns that you are raising there. Thank you so very much, Idiana Togola, for your time, and do keep safe out there as well. Thank you.